representing Air Cruise Aviation Private Limited, Bangalore, Karnataka. Today's topic of discussion will be an insight into uh, career in aviation industry. What are all the roles each one has to play? How the aviation industry is affecting the economic as well as political setup of the country? And what is the eligibility and other aspects of the aviation, country, aviation industry as well as how, how uh, Air Force Aviation Private Limited has a major role in this aviation industry. So let's start begin with the main aspects of aviation industry. One second. Yeah, as I told, uh, today's uh, topic would be insight into aviation industry. What is the role of air transport? If you think logically, um, see the thing is that uh, it is have a great role in tourism of the uh, country, and it has provided various job opportunities to the uh, lot of um, sectors in uh, aviation and key infrastructure wherein people travel from one country to another country and also it has majorly contributed in the terms of international trade. Uh, so one of the major aspects every nation would look after into would be the uh, economy of the country. It has contributed a great aspect in the economy and Air Cruise uh, Aviation Private Limited has um, played a major role in this section. So when we go to the forces that brought changes in aviation sector, um, see a growing uh, expanding income group of middle level people. And in as the income grows, the lifestyle of the people has changed a majority trustful way. And as population increases, the people move from one country to another country, one state to another state, and nobody has a time to uh, wait for uh, a common mode of transport like train, bus, everything. So as the lifestyle is a mode of transport from one section to another section, one country to another country, everything is changed. So all this has contributed to the growth in uh, air uh, aviation sector. Uh, tourism. Uh, as tourism modes, promotional methods, everything has changed. Um, um, aviation has contributed a major thing in bringing people from another uh, country to India and India to another country in terms of tourism too. Uh, when come to the lifestyle uh, which we have derived from aviation uh, industry, uh, see a growth of career path in different levels. Like, for example, mentioned few pilot, uh, air crew, and other thing. People are flying and flourishing their career like anything. That the lifestyle has become a great aspect and. Uh, their level of uh, interaction with people has changed and it is a fun uh, career to be explored. Not only pilot and airport, there will be airport manager, inspector and insurance personality, everything. Their level of uh, lifestyle is been changing and aviation has a great role in that to be uh, explained. Uh, when come to uh, the next aspect, why should I change, choose aviation as a career? Uh, see, aviation and aero industry is very sense highly dynamic and fast paced. Not only in terms of salary package, uh, in terms of um, lifestyle, uh, as I told, lifestyle and the standard of interaction, meeting the people. Uh, for example, air crews. Uh, personalities stay in luxurious hotels, their uh, interactions with celebrities, all these uh, has played into the psychology and the existence of the uh, candidates who has pursued a career in aviation. Um, coming to the next aspect, what is the highest paid job in aviation? See, uh, no, uh, there is not only a, a pilot and airplanes drawing high ransom salaries, 
It is also like air traffic controllers, air commercial pilots, aerospace engineers, operations technicians too. Coming on to the top jobs in aviation. First of all, let us see pilot. Pilot is playing a major role in flying the aircraft to one destination to another destination so there will be a risk involved so for uh, as the saying goes on it is like where there is a pain there is a gain so uh, the risk involved also has gains in it so we all uh, nowadays look for the practical side of every career how career uh, plays a role in our lifetime and how we can establish ourselves with the passionate people. Second topmost job is aircraft technician, aircraft tra uh, traffic controller, airspace program manager, aviation safety inspector, and flight attendants and flight inspectors. Salary range and top jobs depends upon how they perform, how they take the uh, risk, and then all these things. So these are only few mentioned top jobs in aviation you can explore about. So each, each and every job depends upon your passion. If you want to fly an aircraft, uh, you have to uh, have the ambition of becoming a pilot. So if you have to greet the customers inside the aircraft and you have to interact with celebrities, your aspect job would be air crews official and airlines industry has affected uh, a lot in the economics and political aspects of the country. Number 11 issue regarding terrorism has impacted a lot of uh, uh, thing in this aviation industry, but it has always uh, come up by not giving up in these threats of nation. So next is rewarding uh, aspect. Uh, rewarding aspect is that uh, one who has the passion, here goes the saying that one who has this passion has uh, got the fruit. Uh, like that, uh, your career, your passion, everything will be rewarded in the airline industry. And it is one of the growing industry in the aspect of the um, uh, aviation sector. Uh, one thing which I would like to say to people is that reputation. Uh, reputation uh, is that uh, once you enter uh, the uh, airlines industry, right from the beginning of the interview, you have to build a rap so that you have to prepare yourself with some answers to uh, how we have to um, how uh, you have to perform in front you build a reputation with them as well as in your entire journey of career uh, you have a reputation in the industry too. Once you have the reputation and the passion, there is nobody going to stop you in this uh, sector of your career. Remuneration. Then uh, coming on to the remuneration part, uh, see, uh, each airline have a different pay scale and uh, nation to nation, I mean, domestic as well as international aircraft uh, and airline industry will have each uh, pay package mentioning to each sector of its officials. So mention a few aircraft within India. Uh, we would like to mention about Kingfisher, Air Deccan, Jet Airways, SpiceJet, Sahara Airlines, etc. International um, pay scale may be different from US dollar, 2000 to 4000 per month, uh, and Indian um, salary package, uh, it may differ from 50,000 50, to uh, 1 lakh or so, depending upon the designation of each carrier sector in airline industry. One thing I would like to say is that always with every um, advice of mine is passion, develop passion towards particular industry so that you will have a strength in that particular industry. Jumping on from carrier to carrier, not a good advice. 
but why don't you stick to one? For example, aviation industry, try to explore that particular industry so that you can earn as well as you can establish your career. Now, let us have a sneak peek to the vital people in aviation industry. There are a list of um, career uh, aspect which we have to consider in aviation industry. Let us go to the uh, thing. Uh, see, one of the center most attraction in aviation industry is the pilot. Next comes air crew official, air hostess, air inspector, airport manager, airport accountants, insurance agent. We have a lot of aspects. One thing which I always um, look forward was a career in aviation industry from my personal side. And one thing which attracted me a lot as a lady was uh, an airport manager. Um, so it is a very huge responsible job, which we'll come to know in coming couple of minutes. So these are the mentioned few among the various sectors in airport aviation industry. Let us go to the next part. What are the courses available so that you can establish your food into the aviation industry? Well, there are various courses available according to your passion and your way of establishing your food in the industry. To begin with, uh, diploma courses, bachelor courses, MBA and BSc and lot of things like engineering, management, mentioned few is MBA aviation, BBA airport management, aeronautical engineering, diploma in ticketing management and BSc aviation. Okay. Uh, as you see on the screen, uh, the, these are the list of courses uh, which you are, um, which you can develop within the aviation industry. So uh, I hope everything is clear with you people that um, you can select whatever courses you like according to the position you would like to inquire. See. Uh, to mention a few courses, I would like to begin with Aviation Airline Service. MB in Aviation covers full of the air transport industry. Uh, as like any other course in aviation, it provides ample job opportunities. Candidates completing an MBA degree in airline service hold managerial positions according to the degree what they earn. So it is a quite a lot of interesting course which aviation can offer the career aspirers. And scope of MBA in aviation, expected salary after the course. See, MBA in aviation will give you a lot of jobs in aviation or the aerospace industry. Uh, there is uh, uh, one of the thing is that airport manager, uh, air traffic controller, mentioned few cabin crew, human resource management, business communication. Let me tell you whatever designation you pick up, uh, the main essence is communication skill, how you interact with people, how you can um, uh, keep customers to your tag so that uh, yourself is satisfied, customers is satisfied, as well as we can contribute to the nation. Um, few of the leading airlines, which I would like to mention is Indian Airlines and SpiceJet. And next question you would be having is that, what can I earn once I'm done with my MBA uh, course? So, oh, See, there is nothing in hampering like this is the minimum level of earning. Like uh, it can always be from a minimum range of 30,000 to uh, 50,000, uh, 50,000 to one like uh, and all the thing. Uh, yeah. And next come, I would like to tell you is about DBA in airport management. It is a bachelor's degree. Uh, similarly, it also offers various job opportunities and it offers job opportunities in level of managerial skills. And it is one of the uh, booming sector and a very graded 
course which you can have in order to place your foot in the aviation industry. Next, eligibility criteria. Uh, if you are, uh, you don't have to worry about anything. Once you have 10 plus 2 as your basic education uh, and the communication combined with uh, come combined with communication skill and effective interaction skill, you always can make it to the BBN airport management. And duration for this course would be three year undergraduate. And the, in these three years, you can learn about a lot of aspects and the jobs available once you finish BBA in airport management is something like airport manager, assistant manager, customer care executive, safety and maintenance manager. I hope everything is clear to you guys. Uh, find the right road for you. See, a lot of people can put a lot of aspects into your head. You can get brainwashed. See, this is your uh, particular thing of career you have to go. And this is the particular thing of career you have to go. Uh, but ultimate decision should be in your hands. For example, if you are having the eligibility of becoming a pilot combined with the passion, you always can choose the uh, pilot role. If your uh, aim is to become an air crew member, and if you have the eligibility, you always can choose air crew, uh, work as an air crew member. There are a lot of uh, consultants and customer support executives available with Air Cruise Aviation Private Limited to who can consult you with the right option according to your right eligibility. See, all these things contribute to your lifestyle benefits too. I hope this is clear for you. One of exciting course in uh, aviation industry is diploma in airport management. Airport management is one of the exciting career um, which can give you a firm footing in the um, aviation industry. See, controlling, training, everything, airport manager, ground handling, safety and security, every responsibility. Uh, so if you, uh, basic thing is that handling responsibility is quite challenging for you people, but once you get the hang of it, uh, you feel that, yes, I can do it and I can contribute to my nation. And this is one of the uh, unavoidable um, um, segment of nation wherein it give a lot of employment opportunities as well as contribute to the nation's economy. Diploma in airport management. See, if you have 10 plus 2 or 3 year diploma, you are eligible for this course. And um, duration for this would be six months. A uh, job available uh, once you finish your airport management diploma uh, would be aircraft dispatcher, uh, aircraft control officer, cabin crew, airline station manager. Now you will question, uh, what salary can I expect once I did this diploma in airport management? See, uh, so as I always mentioned, salary minimum, minimum to tell you would be 25, 30, 20. Once you perform well in your interview process, uh, mind blowing would be your salary. Nothing to worry about it. And, uh, one organization which I would like to portray in front of you would be Air Cruise Aviation Private Limited. It has different courses within its academy uh, so that it can guide the career aspirers with the right kind of counseling too. So we, this is one of the organizations established based in India who provide a lot of job opportunities as well as career counseling, as well as uh, different courses in its academy. So welcome to Air Force Aviation Private Limited 2. Uh, the uh, pilot, uh, has, I have mentioned you earlier about the jobs and responsibilities of pilot. See, nothing can stop you for solo flight. When you become a pilot, it is one of the major steering uh, 
a holding in your hands wherein you carry a lot of responsibilities behind you in um, making reach from one destiny to another destiny also the entire responsibility of the aircraft contents contents in the sense the passengers the entire um, a uh, thing which is involved within the aircraft it is your uh, shoulder headed responsibility to lead from one destination to another destination it's very challenging let me give you one second time to uh, for you to go through this um, aspects of becoming a pilot as a pilot uh, when you run the aircraft the view uh, down up everything is fantabulous so this is one of the exciting career which you can have in your lifetime see as a cabin crew uh, you have a major role in contributing to whatever aspect it is so the responsibilities uh, of cabin crew oh, while running a the thing would be attending the um, uh, attending the pre-flight briefing, uh, welcoming passengers and navigate to the right direction. See, it all involves um, things like interaction skill and communication skill. You have to explain a flight security procedure. What are the procedure while the aircraft is on the air and on the landing and how the seat bolts has to be secured giving first aid when is needed the pilot may run the aircraft but the next responsibility is in the hands of the air crew officials it has to make the passengers comfortable on the entire journey so you guys would be having a great time with the passengers in making them feel comfortable so the skills of cabin crew let us think one second time see what as the picture depicts the smile wins the business in order to run a business too the smile wins and capture the business a smiling a charming face with a great strength of capacity can run the whole aircraft see main thing which we are looking would be good communication skills once you have the good communication skill irrespective of language uh, the key thing is in your hands excellent interpersonal skill this skill is not in every people's uh, not every people's cup of tea uh, excellent interpersonal skill it means however rough and tough the customers however goofy the customers whatever it is it is your responsibility that you remain calm and run the entire show till the destiny comes and diplomacy and tact then uh, you would be coming across of more than 50 passengers each passenger differ from one to one basis and it is your thing that you have to maintain them according to your tact and the apu also has to have good color vision and hearing not making the passengers embarrassed and one last thing but last but not least is a good general health and fitness once you are healthy and fit you can make others people healthy and fit so that would be the funda these skills are very essential to the cabin crew don't you think uh, cabin crew being a cabin crew is a very exciting career i hope so and you do believe the same this on the screen um you would like to come to know uh, why should you become a hair hostess one most attractive everything would be good package you'll get it's an easy but responsibility job you can meet a uh, famous respond um, i mean personalities traveling and earning hand in hand you can come to know about different countries different cultures and uh, these would be the few points uh, which air hostess can 
earned being a member staff of the aircraft. Fighting is being appointed as an airport manager. See, uh, manage personal and operational activities, manage recruitment and training, uh, ticketing management, providing trans, uh, training to the airport staff regarding safety, everything, everything under the air, in the airport, premises, main road. The senior most airport manager would be having tons of uh, um, responsibility upon his or her head. So these would be a few of the exciting features of being appointed as an airport manager. Aviation and tourism. See, now tourism is flourishing like anything from one country to another country. And the nation is providing uh, so much facilities to all its people in terms of tourism. Tourism not only develops the economy of the country, but also the lifestyle of in and around people of the destination which it is promoting. Uh, for example, um, uh, let us live India. Uh, for example, Dubai. Dubai uh, is one of the countries where tourism is flourished like anything that each year, each year they are um, inventing a um, lot of aspects so that their economy is also very good. That thing, uh, I hope in India, in a couple of years for five year term plan, 2001, I strongly believe that in the term of five years in India, we also will be the topmost tourism providers, topmost tourist country where people from different nations can come and feel comfortable with a lot of sceneries, a lot of states, a lot of cultures and a lot of other aspects where uh, different people can enjoy to their maximum. I hope tourism has to be developed a little more uh, better way in India. That would be a major contributor to the economy of the country. What next? After doing all these aspects, you will be under uh, a stand uh, wherein uh, you have to decide uh, whether it will be a course or a career which I have to choose. I have told you about the uh, courses available. I have told you about the career, what we can uh, proceed with. Now comes the question, which um, organization I have to uh, approach regarding the um, career of mine. Uh, which is the career part, which is a course which I have to take. I would always suggest it will be Air Cruise Aviation Private Limited, one of the established organization in India. People uh, joining with Air Cruise Aviation Private Limited and was, has come always out of the flying bright colors in their career. I am guaranteed for that and you also could explore. Aircrew in uh, Aviation Private Limited. It is one of the newly incorporated aviation service provider in India. And uh, we are uh, looking for uh, initial pilot training, air charters, and HR organization from all over the world. Slowly and gradually, we will be uh, connected to all major related organizations and um, things wherein we can flourish and we also can contribute to the economy of the country. Why get, again question will be, why getting, uh, we are having a lot of um, air crews, uh, service providers, whatever it is, and your question would be, why should I choose air cruise aviation private limited? Uh, see, you have a successful career with us. We can transform your dreams into reality. Whatever is your dream, we establish a rapport with you and guide you, assist you, 
uh, we never force anybody of anything, but if the passion is something very strong, like for example, becoming a pilot, we even make your dream of becoming a pilot into reality. And aviation industry, Air Force Aviation Private Limited provide top quality services on par with international standards. So this is one of the thing, um, uh, which I would suggest and recommend about for you people. And last but not least, I suggest that there is one golden rule, time is money. Nothing should be kept pending. So if your decision is to establish a career, go ahead. This is the right moment. And uh, yeah, right moment for right decision and right choosing of the right organization wherein your career path can be upholded. And this would be my honest opinion for you that do not waste uh, time, which is equally equivalent to money. And you can always choose Air Force Aviation Private Limited for a career path. Thank you very much. Thank you.